I'm Kira, and this is Christopher, and we are here to interview Mr. McCargo at o our, our Lady of the Missions Primary School. Um, Mr. McCargo was in charge of the IT for the Commonwealth Games, and we will be talking to him today. For anyone who is unsure what IT is, can you please give a brief description of what your company does? Okay, IT to you guys is probably computers and Facebook and Snapchat. But that's only part of it. IT is all the computers, where you store your information, how you connect the computers together, and how you present that information on your PD, on your iPhone, or on any device you're looking at. So IT is quite a wide subject. What did your company do for the Commonwealth Games? So our company was responsible for connecting all the stadiums together. So there was over 14 stadiums. We were also responsible for delivering the wireless network. So when you walk about with your, your laptop or your tablet or your phone, you can connect without plugging in wires into the back of your device. Uh, and we were also mainly responsible for the telephone system, which I know you guys also have in the school. So that was the main things that we delivered for the Commonwealth Games. What were the challenges for your company at the Commonwealth Games? Oh, the challenges were many. Um, I think the biggest challenge was we didn't have much time. We were short on time to deliver the IT um, because we didn't get access to many of the stadium until two or three days before the events. So everything was a rush. And we also had to work with lots of different organisations who we hadn't met before. So there was lots of late night planning, there was lots of discussions, and there was lots of decisions that had to be made in a short time frame. Did you enjoy what you did for the Commonwealth Games? Yep, absolutely thoroughly enjoyed it. It was uh, lots of hard work. It was lots of long hours. My wife pointed out to me I was only home for dinner three times in three weeks. But it was, uh, it was really good fun, uh, very rewarding. And when it was over and it was finished, it was a great sense of achievement. When, when did you start IT and why? I started working in IT, let me think, in 46. So 21 years ago, I started working IT. Why? Because I went to college and did a course in electrical and electronic engineering. I was actually going to join the Navy to fulfill that qualification. And then I was offered a job by IBM. So it was a bit of luck and a bit of planning. And that's probably how life works out. Did you see any of your favorite sports at the Commonwealth? Uh, well, my favorite sport would be football. And it wasn't at the Commonwealth Games. But I did, I'm a keen cyclist, as uh, one of the questioners already knows. I do a lot of cycling, and we went to the velodrome, and I got to see the cycling. I was lucky enough to get to the velodrome with all of my family, and I saw both the para cycling and the, the able-bodied cycling, and it was a great event. I thoroughly enjoyed it. Do you think teamwork is as important in IT as it is in a sport, or is it just your, in your computer? Um, well, teamwork is absolutely vital. If you don't work as a team, you will never achieve anything. Um, if you work in sport, you realise you have to pass the ball in netball or pass the ball in football, so you have to work as a team. In IT, you can't know everything and you can't do everything because I'm not clever enough to know everything and there's not enough hours in the day to do everything. So you have to work together as a team. You have to be prepared to delegate responsibility and take responsibility and make sure the job gets done. This is Lewis McKetney and Marjorie Simple talk, thanking Mr McCargo for all his time talking about his job at the Commonwealth Games. Thank you Mr McCargo for coming in and, t and telling us about your 2014 Commonwealth Games experience.